Welcome to another episode of the Planet Zoo series, and this episode we have a special guest. Hello! <laughs> it's Halsey. I never know if you're gonna say, like, I'm a special guest, Halsey, or, like, I never know when it's my turn to start talking. <laughs> so I get very scared. You're like, oh no, it's quiet, oh no. <laughs> the pauses get real long, I think I have to say and then I'm like, God, what do I say? Uh, uh, hello. <laughs> I know, it always says, my wolf just died. It always sounds so panicked, like, uh, hi. <laughs> Someday I will say hello with confidence. Oh, my wolf died. To shed. Yeah. Oh, am I gonna be able to see it soon? Oh yeah. Uh. Is it uh, good enough you could see shit? <laughs> Yes. Okay. Are you allowed to say that? No, oh, I was gonna cut all that bit out. Uh. <laughs> okay. Uh, though I probably should start cursing so that my channel doesn't get deemed for children. Fuckity fuck fuck. <laughs> that should be your like official start. Be like fuckity fuck fuck. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I know. I was thinking about doing something like, I hope you're having a fucking fantastic day today. <laughs> yes. Just to, like, get the child-friendly right out the window. Yeah. It's funny because my <coughs> commenters always seem, like, excited for me to start cursing. Like, I can't wait for you to start dropping the F-bomb. Right. And I've been sitting here trying really hard not to curse. and <laughs> They're all like, do it, do it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So. We have Halsey here because last episode I promised that we would take a look at our both of our wintery zoo. So that's what we're going to be doing this episode. So here is the front of the zoo, and this whole middle bit here in the with the circle is something that is that comes. It's pre-built along with this weird snowy triangle thing and the sheepies. <laughs> We could see here. And you're talking about the snowy triangle thing being the igloo thing? Yeah, the weird igloo thing. Gotcha. Yeah, that, that was there before. Because I don't think in a million years I would have ever built that. <laughs> no. No. Uh, and then out that way is a bunch of staff rooms. And that was pretty much completely pre-built. I did add off the ends. So I added... I think... <laughs> This keeper hut and this vet, I think. No, I think you probably added the pink one because that doesn't have a sign. Probably. I think I added the staff room and then I scooted- the vet was here. I think it was one over and then I scooted it and put the yeah. staff there. I was like, why would I put a vet there? <laughs> and then head back towards the center. Hopefully it's not recording too jittery because I know my computer is feeling it so hopefully it's not recording it too badly. So you come down this here path and then you get to see the reindeer. The reindeer. I, pre I built this the guy in the background for their shelter. There used to be what 10 reindeer in here? Yeah. It starts out it's like place 10 reindeer. <laughs> Let me tell you we felt what it how difficult it is to keep a pen of 10 reindeer poo free. <laughs> All the poo. So much poo. So, luckily the- well, sadly, but kind of luckily, they're, they're <laughs> kind of dying off. <laughs> they're getting old. <laughs> luckily they're all dying! <laughs> Thank God stop pooping! <laughs> there was a lot of diseased reindeer this round. And then all of their little pools of water I made to be like hot springs, so it makes sense they're not frozen over. <laughs> and then on the other side of this big ol' building is some American bison? Yes, American yes. bison. Losing confidence. I am so full of confidence all the time. Most confident person you'll ever meet. Yes. Yes. And then... Kind of trying to go in order of what I built, I think. And then this here is the wolves. And this was built 
on on stream with Halsey. It was Halsey's idea to do this whole big old cave thing. <laughs> so we come in here, and then we've got this nice centerpiece, which I am quite a fan of. And then over here we have our Arctic wolves, of one of which is dead in the pond over there, unfortunately. <laughs> so that should be around soon. And then if we go around, we will see uh, timber wolves, I believe. <gasps> Look at the baby. The baby. Oh, He's so cute. Look at the little toe beans. Yes, yes, little tiny toes. So cute. So yes, this is the timber wolves. Let me out. Thank you. And then... I like how you have all the necessities in the round. You've got benches and garbage and donation bins and heaters and I do figures. Have a heat I do have heaters. That's what. I... Well, that's what used to be here. Now it's just a block. <laughs> I don't know where the heater went. But yeah, I've got little heaters and my favorite part is from the wolves' perspective. It looks like the people are in the cage. <laughs> yeah. Right. <laughs> Uh, and then we head on out of the wolves, and following that, I'm not sure what I did. I put all these buildings out here. Almost all of them are pre-built. And then we got mm -hmm. all of the staff stuff back here. I do kind of like doing this with my uh, heater or the power and the water. Yeah, so it's like little control panels. Yeah, and we can hide those hideous things. Some panels. And then... The, the staff access these guys way back here because let me tell you, getting the arctic wolf space to be big enough <laughs> was a task. Oh my goodness. Yes. <laughs> yes. So, you had to sneak around the back on this side. Which ended up working. Ooh, and then the next thing I built is some of these guest facilities and staff. But then we built the grizzly bear and the bear house. Let's go the into bear the house. Head into the bear house. The vines were there. I did not put them there. I did expand the inside and make the inside look nicer, but the outside was pretty much pre-built. So from here, as you can see, we've got a good view of the grizzly bear is sleeping. And he always has grizzly his butt bear to the booty. <laughs> What'd you say? Grizzly bear booty. Yep, always always facing the window with the booty. And then I hit T so I could spin <clears> around <throat> a little easier. I did plan on putting a um like a food thing or something in here, but I haven't done so. And then out this window Polar Bear! Polar Bear babies. Little babies. Little tiny babies. We had twinsies. So the polar bears, even though they've changed the size. Require a lot of space. So this, plus this, is all the polar bear. And I don't. Do they think... get to see your mouse? Uh, yeah, I think they can. Yeah, okay. they can see. Discord, which she is watching, does not show the mouse. So, all right. So let's see. I think it's like just barely big enough. Dave. Thank you. It's just as slow as molasses right now. Oh my god, it's not big enough anymore. Oh no! <laughs> what? It's because you had two babies. Ah! So, uh, this isn't enough space. <laughs> and this is like half the space they originally required, so. But they cut it down, but ugh, still so much. So we've got the water over here, and we share the water with the grizzlies. And then we have this little ice glass tube. That they can walk across to get over here and this is where they eat and play i think to yeah to help get the guests a good view because making it so that guests could see them in this whole thing is a task so yeah not easy <laughs> but I, th I think it's really cool looking when you're watching right here and a polar bear is walking above you mm -hmm. pretty sweet and then we finished off with these three though two species so we've got this building which I think I actually built apparently <laughs> there wasn't much of that this round and what we have here is a mama and a baby I think 
or no okay we haven't moved him over yet so what this is going to be is the mama and the baby snow leopard and then over in this one will be the male because they want to be solitary so i'm going to keep them separate when they're not breeding and then through this window we have the siberian tiger using his very very big scratch pole <laughs> look at that it's huge it is huge Okay, never mind. He's pooping. He's pooping. He's pooping next to it. We'll just hide that for a second. <laughs> I like how you keep zooming out and the trees parted perfectly to show. So just poop. keep looking at it, yeah. Are you done? Okay, we can come back now. Are you gonna play with the scratch post? No, just wander away. He probably little... played with it and that's why he had to poop. Probably. Got a thing moving. So yeah, this is where they can see him. They can also see down here where the feeding stuff is. Mostly because that's where the staff room is, and I don't want them to have to walk really far to feed them. So they, they get fit over here. And that's the two snow leopard areas. And that's, that's my zoo, I think. Big, almost looks like a peace sign. Yeah, it does. I was aiming for some kind of circle. Uh, circle is a loose term here. <laughs> <laughs> it's a circle that went through the mail. <laughs> There you go. So, yeah, that's my zoo. So next we will be checking out Halsey's. <laughs> <laughs> so here we are in Halsey's game, and we're going to be checking out her park, and this is the entrance. We'll take it from yes. there. Okay, so it's the same with the centerpiece mm -hmm. being rebuilt. And then I built oh yeah is that too fast no i think you should be all right my screen is glitching horribly oh i bet it is so. <laughs> i built these to cover them when they're looking at them that and sound is her each... heater in case anyone's wondering <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty loud yeah uh and each one has whatever kind of animal type it's near so we have the reindeer but on this side, we have the doll sheep. I added yeah. some plants and stuff in there. Yeah, because it was pretty plain more. when we first started. Yeah. And then and you got the heaters reindeer. in those uh window or yes. those little viewing areas. Nice. I do. Yep. And then over here is the reindeer, and I have a pond as well. Oh yes, they love the swimming. <laughs> Yeah, they're pretty much always in there. Do you have one in your shelter that's like mid-flight? <laughs> uh, it kind of looks like it. <laughs> yeah, he's uh doing something. He's taking off. But he's yes, like... so that's my reindeer. And then over here, I've got bison. And then I've got my bison coverage. My little bison statue with his little dubby leg. <laughs> I'd like you to know she gushed and giggled at this thing for like 10 minutes straight. <laughs> I did. I really did. She lost her shit. And then I also did the whole hot spring idea and these guys because they have to have some part of it melted. Mm -hmm. So I used the hot spring idea to melt the grass. Yeah, they didn't like as much. They didn't want everything to be snowy, so. And then I didn't like the big boxed up building that was here, so I made my own little group of buildings here. Looks much nicer than what I had. The one with like the big tall fence, that's the same area. Yeah. Then I've got some hidden underground paths. Path oh, I forgot you'd done and that. Then, yeah. And then we'll just go around this way, follow the path. Um. And it leads to da, 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 da. snow leopards. Oh, Ooh. I can't get over how tiny they are. They're still little. I didn't get to decorate it yet, but at least you got them a cave. They at least have a cave. No, little cute thing. They're one of my favorites. Right, and then I've got some exhibits over here. And I've got a couple buildings for them to eat at and drink. Mm -hmm. And then a naked building. 
Oh, yep. <laughs> I, I covered one and then I didn't get time to cover the other. <laughs> yeah. And so then you get to look at the exhibits and then there's the big crash ship. Oh, this does look nice right there. And I try to make it look like it crashed onto the, like, they crashed because of the coverage. It does kind of look like that, yeah. And nice. then they just tipped over. So then there's bathroom and a bunch of three different drink places, and I built this building. Oh, very um, nice. It's got a bear bite because da, 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 I've got bears over here. Ooh. I also wanted to show my sneaky staff underground path there. Is that the other end of the one across the map? Mm hmm. Oh, nice. It's got power and all that stuff in there and okay. water purifiers. Ooh, very nice. And then this is my. Wait for it. <gasps> Uh, Polar out. bears. So it goes all the way, all the way to where the benches are. That's crazy. So it takes up pretty much my whole screen. <laughs> yeah. Um, and so they've got tons of water, and I think mine have enough. You think yours, <laughs> yours have enough space? Is that what you're saying? Yeah. <laughs> Unlike oh. you, mine have the right space. Oh, that wall's uh oh breaking. You may need a mechanic there. Let's make it. Oh my gosh, it is going so slow. I know. Oh no, my baby made it so I don't have enough space too. Aha! Uh -huh. You have joined <laughs> me on the insufficient size. <laughs> And then, although I could delete some trees, and it would have enough space. Okay. Yeah, probably. They and then they've really got care. a little sleeping area, like a little sleeping cave. Oh, a little a tiny area. ball of bear. Yeah. Oh, that's so cute. But yeah. And then this is a cave viewing area. Yeah. I said that, but I didn't know if it cut out or not. It did. It also cut out when I said something about space, because I said, I think mine have enough space, and we're like, I have enough space? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Trying to fill it in when it cuts out, if I can help it. Um, so this is my grizzly bears. Much more room than mine. They've got a cave, and trees, and a little water stream going through. A little bridge. A little bridge. I tried to give them a little extra room so they didn't look so dwarfed, considering that the enclosure is the same size as yeah. their water pond. Yeah. <laughs> this was my destined for great things strip mall that almost made me lose the entire, you know, scenario. <laughs> it uh, cost you a lot of money there. It, it did. It looks like it had so much potential. It was going to be so cool. It was going to have an exhibit. Or it was going to have four exhibits here. Mm -hmm. And then it was going to have all sorts of like flowers. And then there was going to be like a water fountain. Ooh. And it was going to just be the whole nine. But money's a thing. <laughs> money's a thing. Yeah. And then it had the cool bear because it's near the bears. That does look pretty cool on either side of the ramp. Yeah. Maybe someday. Anyways, so then you follow the path. And da, 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 da. I broke the um, path because they were getting crabby that there was no bathrooms and stuff on it. And there was alternate routes, so I broke it until I could fix it. <laughs> <laughs> but normally that would what lead to the bear cave? Yeah, you can see where it was connected and it goes all the way oh i see yep yeah. through mm -hmm. but i broke it temporarily and this is my mountain that i built that i was really excited about it is a good mountain you're better at thinking of terraforming than i am and then this is my arctic wolves they've got some water 
Then they've got a wigged out something. Oh, fence. Oh. Um, <laughs> not sure why it's doing that. Fine. And then there's waterfall. Yeah. Right Looks pretty good. And then oh. it's got a bear on it because there's no wolves. Yeah, unfortunately. And then there's some icicles hanging off. Oops. Their little cave. Yep, and we got all this, all the space for them in there. Yeah, lots of sleeping room. And then da, 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 here are my timber wolves. So they've got Ooh. kind of a draw that they live in. Mm-hmm. And they've also got a little cave. That one looks snug. Sleeping. Looks warm and cozy. It does. Um, and then my covers have wolves on them. Do you like your little uh, covered viewing areas? Yeah. And then I was really excited about the staff path for this one. Because there's like these little buildings. And mm -hmm. then the sneaky path. Oh yeah, you can't even barely tell it's there. Yeah. So it just kind of looks like they disappear into the trees. And then I was going to have signs for all the different areas. Uh-huh. This was my wolf one that I did. Ooh, that does look nice. Yeah. I like that. Yeah, I think that's everything. Mine is not round at all. <laughs> no. It's always more natural looking. Yeah, I don't even, that doesn't even classify as a shape, I don't think. <laughs> no, it just looks like a normal park shape. <laughs> <laughs> I just can't help myself. And I like my mountains that I did. Mm -hmm. I did a couple on the right-hand side that you can see by the reindeer. Yeah. That's a lot smaller. Did you do, oh, uh, you, you made that water come from the mountain too. The river down into the pole. Oh, yeah. So it goes from the Arctic wolves through the polar bears into the grizzly bears and into the And she did all of that. They, so they... it just kind of looks like a natural mm -hmm. water source that they built around. Yep. The, they clearly left this a huge flat blank area because the polar bears need a lot of space. Right. Good lord. And then it. I... Lifted the bridge so that they look down. Look like they can look in on them. You're brave not having um uh, railings. <laughs> it would be a shame if you know the human population <laughs> fell in. <laughs> Crying shame. Yep. Yeah, they get to look right over the edge of them, swimming around. That's pretty cool. And then I get made fun of because my ponds are <laughs> sort of not ponds. <laughs> oh. I mean. I mean, it doesn't look bad, but please put the polar bear in view for comparison. Because that's the problem. He, he's, he's there. He's there. Where? In the corner. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Do you see him? Yeah. yeah, now I do. He's a <laughs> very tiny <laughs> person. He could dive for days and not reach the bottom of his water. There you go. <laughs> uh, yeah, she builds oceans for her creatures. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, it's, a, it's a little bit. <laughs> a little deep. <laughs> Just a bit. Uh, and then... It's, it's really funny when the little baby bear goes in here. <laughs> mm hmm Because it is just dwarfing him. Yeah, he's just like a pebble on the on the surface there. But yeah. He he's up there. <laughs> <laughs> he's so small I couldn't even see the poor guy. <laughs> even the even the deep the river's deep <laughs> goes all the way down. Oh yeah. Oh. Just an old river. Yeah. Yeah, water's just settled there for a long, long, long time. <laughs> yes. 
How deep is this one? I don't think it's too deep. I don't think that one was too bad, but maybe it's just you've never shown me. Bloop. I mean, it's pretty deep. <laughs> it's not too bad, though. I mean, it's not <laughs> several stories deep. <laughs> I mean, compared to the wolf, though. Is there a wolf in there? No. Pair it with on the edge. Yeah, there's the wolf. Oop. So it's about five times deeper than the wolf is tall. <laughs> well, it's a little closer to reasonable. <laughs> <coughs> Just trying to get it half and half. It doesn't work. I've tried many times. <laughs> I only will do one or the other. It was like it for a second. <laughs> <laughs> Did you ever used to do that in Skyrim? Where you yes. sit there and you try for a really long time to get to the point where you can see all of the lake yes. without it looking murky. <laughs> yes. Like, I need to all see the if there's something down there, but I want to search this murky stuff so you just barely sink in so you could look around like normal. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. So that's my little zoo. It's a good zoo. And I like how it looks like a... a oops. A whale. <laughs> oh yeah, I don't. I don't see the whale. I definitely see a very plump cat with a very long, thin <laughs> neck. <laughs> <That's so funny. laughs> it's blizzard outside. It looks like yeah. It looks like in game, like it does outside. <laughs> I know it has been snowing like crazy. Yeah. So, oh. I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed checking out our two parks. And until next time, I hope you have a wonderful day. Yay!